Imagine for a moment that you can reveal the two contrasting systems that govern your mind. These systems influence your perceptions, decisions, and judgments. Intriguing, isn't it? Suppose you face a simple problem. Quickly solve two plus two. That was easy, right? This is system one at work. It's automatic, quick, and requires very little effort. Now try solving 24 multiplied by 17. That's a bit challenging, isn't it? This is system two, more deliberate, slower, and it requires more effort. But what would happen when these systems clash or work together? Let's dive into the world of the mind. Welcome to the exciting exploration of the mind in thinking fast and slow. This book is written by Daniel Kahneman, a Nobel laureate and distinguished behavioral economist. He delves into how our thinking patterns shape our perceptions and decisions. Today, we take a journey into your mind. We'll be identifying its key operators, System 1 and System 2. Kahneman uses everyday situations to illustrate these systems. When faced with an easy calculation like 2 plus 2, System 1 quickly provides the answer, with no effort required. However, for more complicated tasks such as 24 to 17, System 2 steps in. It exerts more effort and attention to solve the problem. Understanding these two systems can improve our understanding of our decision-making patterns. Have you ever caught yourself responding quickly, driven by intuition, system one? Alternatively, have you spent a lot of time over a decision, debating pros and cons internally, system two? Next, we face the widespread reality of biases in our lives. Kahneman uses characters like Paul to show this. Paul underestimates his risk of heart disease because he lacks immediate examples. This is an example of the availability bias. Often, we are restricted by what we see and fail to grasp the entire picture. Understanding our biases can significantly improve our decision-making skills. Can you recall a time when your decision was skewed by a bias? How did that impact the outcome? Finally, let's examine prospect theory using the Linda problem. Kahneman shows how we often make decisions based on perceived gains or losses rather than the final outcome. You might have chosen options that appear less unfavorable over those that are potentially more profitable but risky. Decisions driven by perceived gains or losses can result in missed opportunities. Can you think of a situation where prospect theory greatly influenced your decision making? From understanding the contrasting systems of thought to acknowledging our biases and learning about the prospect theory, Kahneman's book provides a fresh perspective to view our thought processes. Recognizing these elements can ultimately lead to better decision-making. Unlock the power of a better informed mind. Reflect on how system one, system two, heuristics, biases, and prospect theory influence your everyday decisions. Can you vouch for a wiser and more self-aware you? Stay tuned for more insights that can transform your thinking process and shape your decisions. Ultimately, this can lead to an improved life. Are you ready to read the book? Or would you rather listen to the audio version? Check out the links in the video description.